What's up, good people? Mark Holmes here, and as always, I want to say thank you all for watching, commenting, subscribing, and being part of the Joe Boo Sports Report. Without you guys, as well as you ladies, you know that this literally, literally does not work. I hope everybody's having a great day. It, of course, is Monday, and I, you know, I hope you're having a great Monday, if that's actually possible. I don't know if that's possible or not, but I say I love Mondays because for eight years now, eight years, honey, do you know it's been eight years that I've been live streaming on Monday and Friday nights? No, yeah, she was, I'm surprised she didn't say, yeah, you've been taking my Mondays and Friday nights and spending it online with you guys, but okay. And it's like, I, I should have kept my mouth shut because now it's like, really? Eight, you, you're taking eight years of my time. Okay. Be that as it may, we will be live in about two and a half hours talking about what else the Dallas Cowboys. And even though it is the off season and we are 123 days, I believe, away from the kickoff of the season, there's always stuff to talk about with the Dallas Cowboys. Stephen Jones went on earlier saying that, you know, he believes that Dak Prescott can win a Super Bowl. I know, you know, insert jokes now, trolls. Go ahead, insert your jokes. But one of these days, man, one of these days, we're going to be coming back at you and saying, see, we told you it was going to happen. I don't know if that's this year or not, but we'll see. Be that as it may, he also said that the contract, that, you know, they want to keep him, of course, and that, you know, it takes time. He's a priority. And, you know, I say time is on my side. Actually, it's 122 days. Yes, it is. Yes, time is on our side, according to Stephen Jones, and they're not going to make anything. They're not going to serve any wine before it's time, okay? But here's where it's interesting, because one of the things Jerry Jones had said was uh, about, you know, you know, we've seen teams that have added running backs during the season and gone on, on, gone on to win the Super Bowl. And I can think about the Eagles with Jay Ajayi. I can think about that. I, I can remember that. Because I remember saying that I actually liked Jay Ajay, but the worry was his knees because they said it wouldn't last for very long. Be that as it may, running back is one of those things that the Cowboys are interested in targeting. At least that's where we're led to believe. And here's where it might be that Najee Harris has kind of, you know, let the Cowboys know, come get me, that I am definitely a fan of one Rain Dakota Prescott. Let's go to the tape and listen to what he had to say about how people diss Dak Prescott. The most hate? Oh, Dak Prescott. Oh, that's no no brainer. I don't think people understand how hard it is to play quarterback, first of all, NFL. And not only that, but play for the Cowboys and you winning 11, 12 games a year and you still saying that's not enough. And he don't even play defense. Yeah, 100%. It makes, it makes, like, I understand that, like, you know, and it's but there's, 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 there's not that many teams in the NFL that even has like a quarterback like that. So, I mean, you heard it from Najee Harris, you know, to get that much. He's like, y'all winning 12 games a season and, and you're getting that. And he's like, you know, hey, we're over here at the Steelers and we ain't winning 12 games a season. And we got quarterback that's ass ass. You know, we just traded for Russell Wilson and and uh, for uh, Justin Fields and everything else. And you got that guy, you know, bro, come get me. Now, he supposedly is a target for the Cowboys. And I believe he's one of the few running backs that right now have started out their career with three 1,000-yard seasons. So I don't know if this emboldens, emboldens the Cowboys to want to try and make a trade for him but here's where you can look at these things and and you know the cowboys have not done much they haven't spent a whole bunch of money but the team is not in bad shape we're not great by any stretch of the imagination but there are teams that are a lot worse off as far as talent goes but the cowboys now have tied for the most with i believe baltimore the most comp picks we got four we got four comp picks so you can see the Cowboys saying, you know, we could take our fifth, our sixth, and our seventh round picks and use those as trade bait and have ones to replace them. Now, I don't think they can trade the comp picks yet because they're not awarded until after the season next year. But your current ones you would be able to use. And it looks like the Cowboys will get three fives and a six. 
that's a whole lot more to work with. And when you think about what they did with Stefan Gilmore and getting in Brandon Cooks, you know, if you end up getting a Najee Harris for, you know, a fifth round pick or worse yet, a fourth round pick, which is what we should have had and gotten one of these young guys with the pick that we used on Justin Fields, well, you're not in bad shape. All of a sudden, you're looking a whole lot better than you were. So let's see if Najee Harris becomes the Dallas Cowboys. Dallas Cowboys. Dallas Cowboy. I can't speak. I know what the problem is. You know why I'm messing up and can't concentrate right? Because I have this vision of loveliness who's over here. You know, she got this plant stand that I put together for her and stuff. And so she's going back, back and forth. Back, back and forth. Putting plants up, you know, setting one up, taking one down. Up, oh, nope, look, look, it just, she's just going back. I, I just, I, I just can't control myself. All right, good people. I'm Mark Holmes, and I appreciate you guys listening and getting your update. I'm sorry? You're going to water, see? Uh, well, I'm, oh, I'm sorry. See, see, she just, she just came back with the watering can, and now she's just pouring that water in the flower pots, just looking. Mm. Oh, 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 get get the lower ones. Yeah, get, that lower one looks real dry. That, that, yeah, get the ones down on the bottom there. I, I'm sorry. I, uh, I digress. All right, good people. I'll see y'all soon. Peace.